It is a pleasant Sunday morning. Eight-year-old Bhavesh is walking to a nearby store to buy milk, bread, and butter for breakfast. On the way, he notices water gushing out of a pipe, a common sight in his colony in the early mornings. Bhavesh is aware of the cause: overflow of overhead tanks. Bhavesh is saddened by such mindless wastage of an important natural resource. Let us learn about natural resources and their importance in this lesson. Objectives. At the end of this lesson, you'll be able to define natural resource, distinguish between renewable and non-renewable natural resources, state the features of different natural resources. Natural resources. A natural resource is a stock of material given to us by nature for use. It is not created by human beings. Natural resources are of two types: renewable and non-renewable. Renewable natural resources are those resources that are not exhausted by human use. They are reformed and are available for continuous human use. For example, sunlight, water, trees, etc., are renewable natural resources. Non-renewable natural resources are those resources that are limited in supply. They take years to form. They get exhausted by continuous human use. For example, coal, petroleum, etc., are non-renewable natural resources. Let us now look at some natural resources. Sunlight. Sun is a star that gives us heat and light. It is an important natural resource. Plants use energy from sunlight to prepare food. Without sun, Earth would be very cold, dark, and impossible to live on. Air. Air is another important natural resource. Air is the mixture of gases. It consists mainly of nitrogen, oxygen, and carbon dioxide. Oxygen is essential for the survival of all living things. Water. About seventy percent of Earth's surface is covered by water. Water is also an important natural resource. It is necessary for the survival of plants, animals, and human beings. Drag and drop the options into appropriate blanks. Soil. Soil is a thin layer of earth's crust. It is formed by the breaking up of rocks into small pieces by water or wind. Soils define their texture. Some are fine, others are coarse. Soils also differ in their color. At some places they are red in color, at others black. Soil stores nutrients and water. Plants draw water and minerals from soil. Thus, soil acts as a medium for the plants to grow. It also provides shelter to ants, earthworms, and other insects and animals who make their home in the soil. Forests. A forest is a vast area covered with trees. It is again an important natural resource. Forests give us oxygen. Forest also helps in rainfall. Trees give us wood for cooking, making furniture, and building houses. Paper is also made from trees. We also get fruits, nuts, and spices from trees. Coal and petroleum. Coal and petroleum are fossil fuels which take years to form. They are made from trees which get buried in the soil. They are non-renewable because they are limited in supply and can get exhausted by human overuse. Read the statement.